Hi there, everybody. So I'll get down to the nitty gritty of my order from Book Depository. Here's just some details on the date that I ordered them and the date that they also dispatched, which was about like four days after I placed my order. And I also used my debit card to pay for my books. When I placed my order on Book Depository, they had this pop-up notification informing me like get your books before Christmas if you order now. So I thought I decided to try it. So here is one of the books that came in pretty darn early which was the two week mark which took about like 14 days if I wanted to come from the dispatch date. So I was really happy that it came like early on 17th December so I was pretty happy. The mangas I ordered is called Wotakoi Love is Heart for Otaku written by Fujita in case you guys are wondering. Really excited for the next two volumes that came out. So this is how the box looks like. Sometimes you get the books inside like a really good seal. These are just the cardboard box ones that they normally come in. So yeah, that's basically how it looks like. close-up of the books if you guys want to see how the back cover looks like they look very pretty they came in pretty good condition except for the first volume as you can tell at the top right here it is slightly creased and damaged from I guess the whole shipping process which it's not really a big deal for me because I just what's more important to me is the content that is inside the book and that if everything inside is fine, then I'm okay with it. And as long as it looks good in my bookshelf, I don't mind it. Um, compared to these two, these two were not as bad, but I think one of them, wait, let me see this, how the bottom, yeah, this one, this one, this one came in like good condition, except uh, there's, yeah, there's a little bit of that dirt crease up there and a slight, yeah, like paper crease here. But this is a paperback cover of the mangas I ordered and there we go this one I think was the best out of the lot oh no there's a creasing there but again no big deal for me but I do like how the books are in kind of tip-top condition not bad they're not like nothing's torn or nothing's like folded or anything so I really like that these are the three books that I bought and I'm really happy with my purchase. I do recommend if you are ordering for Book Depository, it's best that you order like the hard covers. That would be really great. So here are my pros and cons that I did in my previous Book Depository review. I kind of updated it here, I guess. I'm not sure, maybe, but for my second experience, I really do like Book Depository service. Like overall, I really enjoy the experience. The only thing that I just don't like is that they're really slow. So don't expect your books to come in like super fast. This is like gifting you a really good book in the next month. So you just got to keep that in mind. I'll give it about a 3.5 out of 5 in case you ever want to try their service. But I do notice that I do not like waiting for my books that come in so late and at the same time when they're slightly damaged as well because they're dispatched from different parts of the world in their warehouse because they do have books from the US, Australia and the UK so the books I normally order are based in the UK so I get the UK dispatch warehouse storage stock in case your books don't get delivered in like the one month duration that they promise to deliver it to you, you can always contact Book Depository and you have two choices which I have heard from other reviews where you either get a refund or they can resend you the book you ordered but you just gotta wait another few weeks or a month to get it. Other than that, I would recommend you guys to try out Book Depository because the deals on 
the prices of the books are really good and it's really affordable and if you're like a bookworm I think this is like a haven for you because you can get all sorts of books from different genre and the website is pretty easy to use. I just like to mention once again this is just based off from my experience with book depository for the second time so I've, I've i don't know sometimes i hear people who have really bad reviews with them but i guess it goes with your gut feeling if you want to try them out this is the end of my video i just want to say thank you guys so much for watching and i hope this helped you out on like in case you want to buy from book depository here is my input they're they're not bad 3.5 out of 5. So that's all for my book depository review and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Take care and goodbye!